Hello, this is the Podcast Producers Podcast with me, Neil Mossy. Thanks for clicking on this. It's a place where podcast producers share their tips and experiences so that anyone can start a podcast and keep it going. I honestly thought when I started this that I would put a lot more of myself in it. Now we're this number of episodes in and I still feel like I need to get to the guest as quickly as possible. For the next few episodes, we're going to be talking with Danny Robbins, who is a comedy writer, playwright and journalist. But he's also created two hit podcasts. There's the Haunted podcast for Panoply and Fulsome Untold, which is the story of Johnny Cash's Fulsome Prison Gigs. He made that for Audible. And one of the reasons I really wanted to talk to Danny was just to ask him what was it like making podcasts for another company where they're possibly funding for higher production values and even a a bigger audience. I'm Danny Robbins and I have spent most of my life uh, writing and also performing, but mainly writing comedy. I found myself at a certain point presenting things and presenting some documentaries on BBC Three and doing stuff for like things like Newsnight and The Culture Show on BBC Two and bizarrely at one point presenting travel programmes as well, doing like tra- travel journalism. So I've, I've kind of done a few things over the years, but comedy has been the kind of the mainstay. And a lot of that has been radio. You know, I've made a lot of things for Radio 4 over the years and uh, have written sketch shows and sitcoms. Uh, I've been sort of radio through and through for many, many years, really. It's how I started. I started out writing topical sketches for the radio. Uh, That's how I got a foot in the door at the BBC and in the kind of comedy world in general. And um, I've gone on and and, uh, like co-created Rudy's Rare Records with Lenny Henry and uh, created a show called The Cold Swedish Winter, which is on now, which is about a man who moves to Sweden and is totally based on my life of marrying a Swedish woman. And so, yeah, I mean, so obviously podcasts and radio are siblings. They're not exactly the same thing. They are siblings and and very close to each other. And I think anybody making radio now has to be looking to the podcast world. You know, I love listening to podcasts. And before I kind of really got into making them myself, I was listening to a lot of them and getting very hooked on on some of the ones that draw you in, like Serial and Up and Vanished and shows that draw you into a kind of uh, box set style kind of addictive quality. I had an idea that felt like it it grew quite organically out of something else I was writing. I was writing a play which featured a, a, um, a relationship between two people, one of whom believed in ghosts and one of whom didn't. And I was kind of interested in, in the effect that had on their relationship. And I just took to social media to ask if anybody I knew had seen a ghost. And I got this huge response of people who said they'd seen a ghost. And I was fascinated by this because it still feels to me like one of the last taboos of talking about have you seen a ghost or not. And, and it changes the way you view people. So I started to collect these stories and then ask the people who were telling them to me whether I could actually go and meet them and interview them. And, and this kind of grew into a podcast. And, and it felt like it wasn't a radio series. It didn't feel like something that Radio 4 would go for. And... Um, and it didn't feel TV in a way, either, I guess, because I wanted that intimacy of the audio medium and I didn't want these people to be kind of judged by looking at them. I just wanted to, I just wanted to hear their story. And, um, and that grew into this podcast called Haunted, which I made last year. And, and, and it became, you know, pretty popular, I guess. And, and um, so that kind of set me off down the podcast world, I guess. And now I find myself with ideas saying, you know, is that a radio idea? Is it a podcast idea? That's Danny Robbins, and this is the Podcast Producers Podcast with me, Neil Mossy. It's a place where podcast producers share their tips and experiences so that everyone can start a podcast and keep going. There's details of how to subscribe in the description. Thanks so much for getting to this point in the podcast. And thanks again to Danny. The links to him and his podcasts are in the description. And if you've got this far into the podcast, it's really good to have you here. Why not give me a thumbs up or a comment or tweet me? It'd be lovely to hear from you. And there's also details in the description for where you can find the next episode. Can you please help my daddy get 1,000 subscribers? Just click on his face. Thanks. Bye. Bye.